we're, we're gonna look at these um costumes these skins i really like this i really like this for blood down i don't know people who play apex maybe you also can give me your thoughts but look at that i like the i like the um i guess that's the theme right kind of mech horror mech it's pretty neat almost like steampunkian um this one's really cool the only thing i don't like about this is like there's not enough of the the hair like there needs to be more fur and the claws need to be way bigger like i think it should be way more animated than this this looks like an a adult version of what the skin should have been like it feels lacking a little bit listen to florida i live in florida we are not the same oh my god good i'd rather listen to florida and not live in florida you can have the latter part of that so I think for this, I don't know what I'm rating it at. I mean, like, four, four out of five. 3.5 out of five. Um, ooh. This one's okay. This does not feel like a, a legendary, though. This feels like a le recolor. I do see that the... His hairstyle is a little different. I don't know. Something about the screams, well, bye... <laughs> very bi vibes or like sapphic i think because it's like kind of pink magenta but i don't feel like again it's like really muted like this the the thing i have about this and this they have similarities in how i feel about like kind of it not being its best possible version yet like it's getting there but it's not perfect so i think 3.5 out of 5 this one oh my god maybe i'm maybe i'm biased but i always see this and i'm like oh my god he's fucking like electro but like that's so cool i don't know but mixed with like resident evil shit like i don't know something about this speaks to me and like it's such a good skin see it's much more pronounced like i feel like this you compare it just to this they really went all out with like like even the name synthesis chamber i feel like i would have liked if it, it was synth synthetic chamber instead of two nouns, but anyway, that's just me. Rock. <laughs> yeah, caustic really became an independent variable. Oh my god. Yeah, honestly, like, look at that. Like, the, I, I can't see it because you can't. Ah, I hate this. Why can't you zoom in? But there's like an amount of detail in the back of this. So, but even just looking at this and look at that. The, I, I can't zoom in, but like this part. You, like if you have apex just like see it for yourself oh my god it's so cute yeah i love this perfectly yeah, executed okay this is the first thing i saw too i was like glancing and i'm like oh new uh hemlock skin r301 and like spitfire this is really cool i like this it's a little too um wait this is the hemlock right it looked like the flat line for a bit for some reason now I really like this. I don't know if I'm like really wanting to be like, oh, I want it or whatever. It's it's like a detail. Like it's red, right? If you like red, if you have, I think for me it would work if I have the the skin that goes that blends well with it. So this one with this one, like if you have the sear skin with this, great, love that for you. Synthetic chamber wouldn't make sense as its name. It would suggest that the chamber is synthetic and not the chamber synthesizes material. Well, is that is oh yeah, you're right. All right, I give that to you, Axels. Um. Oh. Okay. I would love to have this. You know why? It makes a Spitfire small and thin and narrow and i feel like that's one of my problems with the spitfire all of my skins even in my original account on like playstation all of them are big like i think i have two that are makes the uh, the entire gun smaller like a little bit sleeker but yeah this one makes it way sleeker or maybe it's just kind of an illusion because of the way the the barrels are but i mean i like it i want to see it actually in person or in like the firing range it would be nice 
I hope they let you, you know, um, even if you're not gonna buy it, like, maybe try a skin on in the firing range. That'd be great. That would be nice. I want candy versions of crayons so I can go about my day eating from a package of crayons. Why? Why? Just get normal candy. What is wrong? Okay, I know. Don't answer that question. I think it's a rhetorical question to be like, what is wrong with giant axolotls? As he said, your words, not mine. A lot of things. Okay, this one is okay. I don't like it. You know why? It doesn't get rid of this. I wanted to get rid of that stupid circle, iron sight. I'd rather just have this and nothing over here. That's just me. It, this gets in the way. Um, exposed wiring? Unless, obviously, I pick up a sight in the game, but... Why? Because I don't wish to eat normal crayons. However, I will if I must. But I'm saying, why does it have to be edible crayons? Why can't you just do away with the crayons and eat normal candy? That's what I'm saying, like, branded candy that it already exists. Why do we have to go to inanimate school supplies to make edible? I don't get it. Then again, there are people that make cakes that are out of, like, real inanimate objects. So maybe to each their own. I don't care anymore. I really don't have an opinion. I don't want to keep formulating one. How will I sow the seeds of chaos if I'm eating fucking runts? Runts? Runts is not the right word there. What is a runt? Is that is that candy in the U.S.? Because isn't runt like a like a brat? Like what? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Axolotls. Time out again. Time out. Boom. Yeah, it is. It is actually. Send me a fucking picture of this candy. There's no way they named candy runts. Oh my god, America. Anyway, going back to the R301 skin, it's called Exposed Wiring, and this is pretty fucking, pretty clean, gotta tell you. But again, getting any one of these really requires you to be like, I would love to pair this up with this. This is the thing that pairs up with the R301, like, oh, that, and this is, this is a 4 out of 5 skin, in my opinion. I might even give it a 4.5 out of 5, so yeah. I like the asymmetry of it. Like, it looks... In, like, if you think about it, this whole build, this whole skin, is designed to be asymmetrical. Look at the knees. Look at their eyes. Look at their arms. One has more of the... Uh, well, one has ar Archer. One has this, like, weird bionic arm looking. And also the the, the shoulder. Shoulder pads. Or they're not pads, they're more like, I don't know, protectors. Like, look, I love that. It's made by fucking Nestle. No, Axel, send me. Did you, did you send it to me? Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait. You unlocked something in me. I've had this. But I don't think it was called Runts. Hold on. Runts candy. Like, it has to be called something else. No, I've had this. Oh my god, was it called Runts this whole time? Oh my god, I think I had- I, I just experienced, like, Mandela effect. Runts are good, but only banana. I agree, I agree, I remember! Yeah, and they're kind of, like, hard candy-ish. Yeah! Bro, bro, what? Wait, it was always called Runts? For some reason, I, I could- no, I, I see this yellow box, and I'm like, there's no way. Wait, I have to show chat. Can we can we talk about this? Can, what? Runts? My local mall only sells the banana runts. Yeah, I remember. Like, it, it unlocked. I think I, I just have so many years of trauma that I totally forgot what the name was. But I as soon as I saw this, I instantly remember the box. Like, in everything, the design. And that they're, like, small, hard candy shaped as fruits. Holy shit. Anyway, that's a, that's a time. 
I don't know how we got here. Well, you, you, you got us here. Okay, axolotls. Too many derailments now. Okay, do you want me to play other games? I feel like I, I kind of want to play other games. After this, after, after Apex critique of the new skins. I was thinking of playing Valheim. I don't know, what should I play? I, I was planning on playing Animal Crossing. Like, I feel like it's such a... I also like not streaming it, because, uh, yeah, streaming kind of takes the fun out of it. A little bit. Um, I could also play... <gasps> Ooh, okay, I'm just gonna see if there's a lobby in Nerds. I'm totally gonna play Nerds if there's, like, a active lobby. Yo, please. Oh, there's none. I'm so sad, Nerds. Nerds is, like, such a dead game. Holy shit. Um... Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, we'll see. What is going on in the like Discord? Discord. The things I've seen. Oh my god! You're. <laughs> Thank you for being our first ever bad bun. Prototype. Or, you know what? Better t better yet, test subject. I found candy crayons. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Don't scare people, but maybe do. Because following the rules... Evil. Evil. I don't have an evil emoji. Oh, well, I have I have this, kind of. The Elmo fire. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, I got, I got distracted. Okay, let's do this. Come on, guys. Focus. Focus channel point. <sighs> oh, ew. Okay, um, straight up, like, one out of five. I don't like the way Rate looks like here. She kind of looks like a bad re, like, imagination of, um, what's her face? What's her name? Nebula in Gardens of the Galaxy. Or Marvel Universe. Ooh. Okay, this is why why is it so muted? Like I feel like this could be more. There could have been more here, I feel like. Like they basically leave her bottom part pristine and only like have like I guess cause she's wearing these boots, but I don't know. I feel like this could be a bit more this feels sanitized, you know what I mean? Like it could be more dirtier and like more horrific than this. I love it though. Like, I love that it's basically her base default skin. A little bit lighter, a little bit different, and then, like, obviously zombified. Great. Ooh. Why does she look like that? She looks like the ex machina. Or machina, I don't know. Like, robot? The AI? Just the face, though. But, like, everything else definitely looks Valkyrie. Also, for some reason, this reminds me of Transformers. <laughs> Um, guys, I'm so confused. Uh, 2.5? I don't know. Oh yeah, I forgot to give the cosmic one. Uh, I would say, like, this is, like, 3. Yeah, this is 3. Um, I don't know. You guys can tell me your opinions. Like, Spatial Anomaly does not correlate with this. I don't think I like that name for it. And just, in itself, like, this, her face does not, it doesn't make sense. Probably 2.5. Nice try though, because the level of detail in this one's nice. Her face looks weird. Ooh, okay. Whoa. I know it's like an epic skin, but they could have at least changed his like hair color to be like, I don't know, radioactive. But instead, it, I mean, I guess he like has gooey alien shit, I'm assuming. Yeah. Oh my god. Like, 
if they gave this Gibby skin the same energy as this, but obviously a little bit not too premium because then that that would make that would have to make this a legendary. I like the colors though. I feel like they could have done something more up here. Like I would have totally mistaken this for a uh, legendary skin, honestly. Um Oh, that is cute. Okay, now we're on to the charms. That's pretty cute. It, I think it's big. So this is my big issue with... Uh, one of my main issues with charms. They're great in theory. I love collecting them. But when you actually equip them on any of the weapons, it doesn't really serve anything. If In fact, like it might impact your, your aim. Because it just takes up a big chunk of your screen and I, I know like which one is it oh yeah the the bullying charm for lifeline like the big doctrine i can't show you here but it's on my other account but it's so huge like, i had to stop using it because it took up like 20 percent of the gun like, i'm not kidding some of the charms are so big like this one looks so big can you see that i i, I wish i could rotate it like there should be a way to rotate it the only thing is actually buying it. That sucks. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Again, I like the concept. I don't think it would look good on this gun. Maybe in a different gun, that'd be great. Like, but not a P20. Like, not a smaller gun. Like, it has to be proportioned, proportional to the, the weapon. This is good, too. Um, I wish there was more. But I, I, I it, this would be cool to have with, like, you know, Gibby skin, right? So... I'm not going to give any of these, like, an actual number. Good or bad, pretty much. Ooh. No! I don't like this because I feel bad for the Marvins. But then it's also like, Gas Daddy, no! Don't do that! But then you kind of still feel bad for Gas Daddy for some reason. Like, I feel like I'm defending an abuser. It feels gross. Okay, this one... I mean, I like it, but my heart tells me to say I don't like it for legal purposes because it's basically abuse of a robot. But then people will be like, I don't care. I think it looks dope. They don't care about robots' feelings. And that's you, I guess. Okay. Revenants, I like that. It's basically everything about him. I, I love... <laughs> okay. Now I'm finding this animation where he jumps towards you onto the screen, like... It's kind of corny. It's not scary. Like, the first time you see it, I don't even think it's that scary. With this skin, though, it, a, a little bit, if you, if I had the right kind of banner po like banner, and this is my banner pose, oh my god. Like, look at that face. Like, I straight up look like some shit from Diablo. Ooh. Oh, this is cool. I like this. Oh, instant. Maybe I'm biased, but everything they put out for Bloodhound, it's usually pretty good. They deserve better. And they do. Get it. This is cool, too. I like these close-ups. I prefer for the banner poses that this is just me. But the ones where you get more of like a, yeah, like a half-body close-up of the, um, the legend. That's pretty cool. It's more detail. I like I I I I all I always think that this gives more personality than the ones further back. It's so much more intimate. Full moon over Skull Town. That's actually oh that's actually really cool. What? <laughs> they actually put Reverend's real name on there. That's hilarious. Caleb Cross and Lobandrade, a Hammond Pictures production. Okay, I love that for the reason that this is probably one of my favorite, like, you know, plot lines in this game. Is, like, Loba and Revenant's, like, story together and against each other and all that. Like, her, they're, they're so inter intertwined. Oh, I like this. Oh, I guess this is the thing. Oh, okay, they're trying to, like, parody... Oh, okay. Like, it's, they're inspired by, like, 80s horror movie posters. Okay, I like this. This is pretty cool, too. Like, that's so fucking wild. I wonder who thought of this. Like, I wonder who's like, mm, I'm in, like, such a 
film buff mood. You know, and I work at Respawn, and it's like, why not? Let's give a little pizzazz, like, you know, give a little homage to horror in our game. I mean, the most horrific thing about Apex right now is the amount of fucking server issues that still plague this. It's like, maybe fix that first, and maybe Apex will stop feeling like a horror game when it's not even October. <laughs> I said what I said. Um, this is okay, too. Obi Edelassum, that's uh, Sears' real name. Tejun Park, Renee Hope Bla Blasi. I didn't know um, Raid's middle name is Hope. Wow, I learned something new today. Yeah, that's cool. I don't know what it's about though. I feel like I'm missing like a, a, a lore component here. Yeah. Like maybe, yeah, I'm missing a story or something. Rise of the Blood Bot. Oh, I like that. I don't know why it's called Bloodbot though. Could have been something else. But I like this though. It's so minimalistic. Like this. If you took took out the text part, I would have loved to just have that. But yeah. This is cool. Again, I feel like this would only work if you have that weird um Valkyrie one. Cause then I don't see any other skin fitting this this banner oh this is okay you could use this at any point like i like these uh rare ones i don't mind getting some of the rare ones because some of them are generic enough that most like i mean in this case i don't have a good race skin other than the champion edition skin and so this one like if you have more than one skin obviously it, it could probably fit this banner it's all about the aesthetic for the banners it really has to fit this one's cool I doesn't it doesn't fit my banner though, but I would love to have another like banner for Horizon, something else. And another skin. Like I can't wait guys to just like I am gonna buy the battle pass just because I I do wanna unlock the Horizon skin. I feel like I worked so hard. I'm surprised I've I've gotten past level fifty on the battle pass. For the amount of hours I've been playing Apex, like which is not even compared to before. Uh, good for you for doing charity stream. Yeah! Um, Splute, thank you again for being here. I don't know where you went earlier. I did ask you, like, how's your day back? But it's okay. Um, I want to do charity things in November. Do it! Yeah. I don't know if you want to, like, do something similar to what I'm doing. Like, I collaborate with this organization. They're a non-profit charity called Stream for a Cause. And that's actually what I'm gonna be, um supporting for the the stream at the end of October. So what they do is like um support other smaller nonprofits. So usually we have to get like the organization um recruits volunteers, you know. So this is a volunteer position. Like I stream for, you know, um stream for a cause and like do campaigns and stuff like that. So I I've been part of like raidathons where um there's like a dozen um streamers doing the same charity event they're all we're all raising towards the same collective goal and then we raid each other one after the other it's pretty cool it's like very unique like there's no one that does this <laughs> and like i think it's really cool and um i'm surprised at the amount of like professionalism in that organization like in stream for a cause so if you ever want to check them out like honestly if you want to know even just like know something about how to organize a volunteer uh like a charity stream like volunteer for them like i i i i find that like when they first started they were you know they're still trying to figure out stuff but they were really good at like especially if you're a new streamer like how do you set up your incentives they help you with that how do you set up your elevator speech to be like oh like hey guys you know i'm stumbly i'm doing this charity stream like doing that every few times because that's what you're supposed to do right like there's a certain amount of rehearsal they need to do it for the charity streams and like organizing if you're going to give away merch or anything like that like you have to get that all ready so um i will yeah for sure so if you just go to that website honestly and you, you even like if you just want to see how other people have been doing it but yeah i must go sorry i wish i could stay longer oh that's okay are you starting stream like could you tell us if you're streaming like i'm fine with you know knowing because i might might hang out there yeah, like take a break after this and yeah usually i like to just leave like lurks on but if i'm not feeling tired i'll usually like haunt the twitch streams that i follow and pop in but yeah 
um whenever yeah for sure like honestly uh oh one more thing if you're still here and you heard everything i said thank you for joining the discord just make sure you um um get the verified role because then you won't see anything but yeah feel free to use the like i have a promotion channel for like you know twitch streams let us know if you're like live i don't always get the twitch notification so probably one of the best ways and i have a tips resources channel there for like anything and if you need help with like a stupid you know streamer thing or like you know i don't know like or like about this charity let me know like i can we can talk about it in like a voice chat or something so um why i'm so in and out of chat that's okay yeah no i mean yeah go ahead Just please start your stream um yeah i'm probably gonna um take a break then think about what i want to play um that's not apex after this so you can do the same yeah for sure no problem have a good one okay yeah that's okay i got distracted but but uh yeah thank you for the lurk um is that it no this was it okay uh this is so weird i don't think this fits gibby in my opinion I guess if you have that, what was it? This one? Yeah, sure, but eh. And then these ones are just oh these are pretty pretty cool, like the banner trackers. I always like these. I I, I don't know if I'm actually gonna get I don't know if I'm gonna get the event packs, because you can, so that's what I was gonna show after because we're done and i don't think i'm gonna like look into these banner they, they, i already think they're really cool because but you know they're special like not everyone gets these trackers unless you get the packs so that's another thing like there's so you i can't even imagine spending four hundred dollars like that's crazy if, to get every single apex pack but it's not is it even guaranteed like i don't think so or is it like, I'm curious, maybe I'll just buy one. Honestly, I'll just buy one. Okay, there's guaranteed one thematic item. Okay. Okay, let's see how this goes. I hope it's something that I like. After rating all of them, I feel like I deserve a little treat. Okay, so where do I... Okay. Alright, moment of truth. Oh, I didn't get any legendaries? Oh, I got this. I actually did like that. Oh, man. No, there has to be another Y. Yeah, this event pack is so stupid. Like, okay, 1 out of 40 off the chance that you actually are guaranteed one. That's crazy. That is so wild. Okay, I say that and I'm like, okay, I want to bet my life. I will. Oh! I accidentally bought two, and I ran out of Apex coins. Oh, you love to see it. God, I wish I could transfer my Apex coins from my PS4 account to here. God damn it. And let me guess, I'm not going to get a legendary. Oh my god, I wasted money. And I get just the one Bloodhound tracker? Are you kidding me? And like, now I have to get the fucking... All of them. Like, that's so stupid. Like, that is honestly one of the- I don't like the, the way that's set up. And why did I accidentally oh, bought another pack? Hello again. Yes, thank you for contributing. I am about to finish Apex Legends, and I was thinking of playing Stardew Valley, or Animal Crossing, or anything that- or Solitaire even. Oh, yo, there's not- it's not even- that's not even fair. Like, okay, I'm gonna get this because I don't like it to be incomplete. Like, we have to get- Is that it? Damage is Bloodhound. Oh, no, I have to get this. Yeah, okay, we have to complete the banner tracker. Like, there's no way I'm gonna leave that hanging. Like, I unlocked the one, and like, you need all of them. You need all of them. Oh, wait. 
<laughs> I made Bloodhound into- I made them into a fucking, like... Oh my god, I dismembered them by accident. Look at this, so funny! <laughs> hey, yo. Fine. I'll flip it. But that was pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> See, now I wish I get that skin. Now should I should I buy some more Apex code? No, I don't. I don't have money. I'm I'm really broke right now. <laughs> I'm not trying to make you guys feel bad about me, but I do have one more pack. Maybe I'll actually get this one. Please, this one for my NB pals. Please, for the love of the All Father, give me. A legendary! No! There's no way! Oh, okay. That's just a normal... It's not even... A... I hate that so much. I didn't even get a fucking skin. Like, none of these? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Well, I ran out of Apex coins. Never playing this game again. <laughs> Life is pain. Life is absolutely pain. Love. Um, I forgot about strawberry allergy. Innate strawberry pie fill filling. Now my mouth feels weird. Life is pain. <laughs> I feel bad for you. I'm sorry, son. I don't know what to tell you. Life ain't a box of chocolates. I feel like I should play this meme. We should- I, I'm allowed to play one meme. You are cookie yes. monster. <laughs> they ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Uh, 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 I have so much of that. But there's so much memes, not enough to catch up. I want to add more memes, but at least it tastes good. Well, yeah, but hopefully you don't die from your from I, from the allergy. But then that's like the same energy of people like, yeah, I know I'm lactose intolerant, but is that going to stop me from eating cheese? No! And then they all... Okay, that's it. I'm done. Let's exit out of this game. I'm good. The pain subsides now that I've terminated Apex.exe.